Too many things to do to be mad at you. And I just gotta do what I gotta do. In tune, my latitude, and I'm feeling too smooth how to ever lose. But I still had to take a lot of losses. I still had to make a lot of crosses. I, I still had to break a lot of bosses, and I've been going so hard, I'm feeling nauseous. But I'm playing the safe because I'm cautious. I know that I can't let it fall yet. I know that they haven't made the call yet, so I'm just respecting the process. And I know that's a hard pill to digest, but I ain't complaining on letting God crest. I'm speaking my peace whenever I flex, and they listen to me when they define best. And they love the moments whenever I'm looking so alive, feeling so good, shining like light, looking so bright. Knowing I can do this shit every single night, and I'm back in the motherfucking city like I love something. Please don't hit me in my DM unless it's about some money, making money, maybe we can make something happen. Because my network's like my sweatshirts, and I can make your head box and your neck hurt. Yeah, this that new level, if you fucking with it, let a nigga know something. Got the seeds if you ever want to grow some. Nigga Ben had the keys and the blow on. See these big black wings and the flow on. Make a motherfucker bang when I blow on. Heaven watching over me and I'm on something. I can't even put it into words. And these whack niggas getting on my nerves. I swear to God, that bullshit be for the birds. I'm about to kick that bitch shit to the curb. Cause I be on the grind from the first to the first. Yeah, black on the verse and I spaz on the beat. I keep a litter like the trash from the streets. You see me handsome and I flash in my teeth. Now these pretty girls asking for me. I'm just posting it in my zone on my phone and then these pictures of my baby which I I done been in the Marines, 
I didn't, I didn't went to college. Like I didn't did all type of shit in my life in, in a very short time. And ain't nothing more scarier than getting in front of motherfuckers that you don't even fucking know and trying to tell them everything about yourself. Like, that's the scariest shit in the world. Even in religion, like, even if you believe in Catholicism, like, you gotta do that shit in front of one person and they behind the fucking door. If you're doing a confession and shit, like, I can tell y'all all about me and still go to sleep like a baby at night. And it'd be a lot of fucking eyes on you doing this shit. And I didn't watch people come month after month to get up on this fucking mic in front of a lot of motherfuckers for the first time. Like for the first time, the first time I ever performed poetry, it was in front of like a room like in a coffee house with like seven people in it. And I was then about to piss on myself. <laughs> and that shit freaked me the fuck out. It was like seven white people and I was in that motherfucker talking about black power. <laughs> Y'all laughing, but I'm like, shit, it took some shit like that to do shit like this. You know what I'm saying? So, but some people, y'all be scared to just talk in front of two people. Some of y'all don't even want to talk in front of one person. Like, some of y'all that scared. Some of y'all don't even think y'all, y'all don't talk to the motherfucker that y'all fucking. Like, y'all don't, y'all don't even talk to y'all fucking pastor. You don't even talk to your manager when it's a complaint. You just keep that shit in and be mad at work. Like, you can fix that shit, just tell the nigga you got a problem with a nigga. And if you just figure that out right now, I just saved your fucking life. I like that one clap, thank you. All these motherfuckers in here, that shit got one clap. Thank you for keeping me hungry, dog. I appreciate it. Um, so keep sitting down. <laughs>